how to choose the right contact lenses for you. Hello and welcome to VideoJug. I'm Stephen Bailey. I'm an ophthalmic surgeon, an ophthalmologist. That's a doctor who's specialised in eye diseases and eye surgery. And I'm here to tell you about different sorts of contact lenses and how to use them safely. Type 1. Soft disposable lenses. First type of lens are the soft disposable lenses. They're the most common uh, type in use today. And they come in a, a variety of, of flavours, if you like. The, uh, there are reusable ones that are disposed of perhaps every year or so. Uh, there are monthly disposable lenses. And there are some lenses that are disposed of every two weeks or, or every day. The most economical to use are usually the reusable lenses that uh, are worn on a daily basis for up to a year or so. Daily disposables are very convenient. They're great for occasional use and they're superb for travelling because you do not have to travel with a lot of solutions which are heavy. Uh, but they do work out more expensive than the other types. So if they're worn every day, uh, then it's a relatively expensive option compared to a reusable lens. All the reusable lenses, all the ones that are disposed of every year or so, or every month, or even every two weeks, do need a rigorous cleaning and disinfection routine. Type 2. Extended wear lenses. The second type of contact lenses are soft lenses again, but instead of being worn just for the day and being taken out in the evening with no overnight wear, they're intended for continuous wear, day and night, uh, for a variable period, usually up to about a month, when they're replaced. The most modern lenses that are intended for continuous wear are called silicon hydrogels. They're soft lenses again, but they have a silicon material in them which has a very, very high ability to transmit oxygen through the lens. And they are capable of meeting the requirement of the uh, surface of your eye for oxygen even during overnight wear. However, there are other issues with these lenses. and. Uh, it appears from current evidence that they may be no safer in respect of possibly sight-threatening corneal infections than the older type of uh, continuous wear lenses from 10 or 15 years ago. Type 3, hard contact lenses. They were originally the first sort of contact lenses way back um, in the 50s and 60s, but they've largely now been supplanted by more modern materials. The problem with Perspex lenses was that they didn't allow any oxygen through the lens itself. They had to be made quite small, therefore, to allow a good flow of tears underneath the lens to supply the surface of the eye with oxygen. They do still, however, have some place, but it's mostly for special needs. Type 4. Rigid gas permeable. They look rather like the hard lenses from decades ago, although they're usually slightly bigger. The difference is that they're made of a material that allows oxygen to diffuse actually through the chemical matrix of the lens. So they combine the, the, the best of many worlds. They give good comfort over long periods on the whole, although generally not quite as good as a soft lens, but they're much more suitable for longer periods of wear. They still need very careful use and very careful cleaning and disinfection, but overall, these are the safest type of lenses available today. Type 5. Coloured cosmetic lenses. And they usually have a pattern on the surface, and the intention of this is to change the apparent colour of the person's eyes. They may also have an optical power, so they can correct vision too, but they're not always used for that purpose. It is very important that these lenses are still fitted uh, by an, op an ophthalmologist or a suitably qualified optician they have the same uh, risks as, as any other lens type, and they need looking after in the same way. So they have to be taken seriously. Type 6, custom lenses. These lenses fall into several different groups. So there are custom soft lenses for treating high degrees of astigmatism, or sometimes uh, they're used for uh, treating or correcting the vision um, in medical conditions such as keratoconus. Most of the custom-made lenses, though, at least for special uh, purposes, are rigid. They're made of gas permeable materials and they come in a wide variety of sizes. And these are lenses that are used again for conditions of the cornea like keratoconus or after some operations on the eye like corneal grafts. Finally, there's a group of lenses that are used mostly for medical purposes 
and the intention is often to disguise a disfigured eye. These lenses are mostly custom made and many are hand painted to match the fellow eye. Good, well now you're able to go out and enjoy using your contact lenses. But do remember, always take the advice of your contact lens practitioner and do attend for regular checkups every year.